So uh, my name is Amanda Henry and I am offering a Learn to Knit class at Arlington Common. Actually we're going to offer two, uh, the evening of the 6th of March and the evening of the 13th of March and you can go to Arlington Common to find out more about it. Um, it's free and uh, it came about because we did a stash swap for hand workers last fall and so many people donated yarn and needles and others said oh I would love to do that but I don't know how to knit and I'd like to learn so I'm offering a class and um, the idea it'll be very basic so we'll learn how to cast on and a little bit about knitting and get you started and uh, I've knitted since I was five uh, but I've always been a much more enthusiastic than accurate knitter and that all changed when I moved to Arlington and I heard that there was a knitting circle on Tuesday nights at the wayside from six to eight um, and I went and I not only uh, enjoyed the knitting there but made some terrific new friends. It was just such a good way to get into the community and um, feel a little bit more as if I was at home. So I'm going to offer this class a couple of times uh, in Arlington and people will learn to hopefully get the knitting bug. But more importantly than that, uh, we'll learn who your neighbours are and uh, who might like to get together outside the knitting group and form their own knitting group or handwork or anything else they really want to do. So I started off knitting very simple things, um, sort of like this, which is what we're going to be learning in the, in the uh, class. And then I sort of graduated on still simple things on big needles. And so this is one of those infinity scarves. But this is all stuff I've done this year. I, I knitted a, a sweater. I'd never done anything quite like this before, but I got such encouragement from my new knitting friends that I decided just to go with it and try things that were different. So I ended up making a, a shawl, um, which is kind of fun and warm. And I thought this was the most difficult thing I'd ever made until I started doing these guys. And I'm utterly, utterly hooked. Um, instead of a baby, gifts for that were worn once and never and never worn again I thought I'd rather make things that might have a little longer shelf life so this is Bar Bar the black sheep and she has three bags that will be full when they're delivered she's also going to have a little coat but that's not done yet but that's Bar Bar and then uh, this is George and uh, George Unlike Baba, who's going to England for a baby, George is going to stay local. So you may see him because George is actually going to live in Dorset with a little boy. So I do hope you'll come and learn to knit if that's something you've always wanted to do. Uh, it's fun and you'll meet new friends. I'd love to meet you. I don't have a lot of friends. I've been here a very short time. So please come to the Watkins house uh, from 6 to 7.30 on the 6th of March and again on the 13th. You do have to register so please register at info at arlingtoncommons.org and I look forward to meeting you then. And uh, George says hi and bye. <laughs>